With Wyoming's cold climate, it's sometimes a great idea to get started early with your plants for the garden. We can always do that by starting inside with some either artificial lights or using some actual sunlight through a window. There's a variety of options that exist for getting seeds started inside, but the main thing we want to think about is that we've got some sort of material that those seeds can get started in, and that container will allow those seeds to have a medium to hold moisture so they can get started and start a root system. We also want to think about making sure that these seeds have temperatures that are warm enough to get them germinated. Uh, with some of our cooler season plants, they obviously don't require as warm of temperatures, but some of our warm season plants, such as tomatoes, peppers, squash, they're going to require warmer temperatures to actually get germinating and get those seeds going. If you're looking to raise the temperature for some of these seedlings, you might consider some heat mats or placing them next to a heater or something else similar. Uh, as far as materials that we can use, we can just use a basic potting soil. Then we'll want to go through, water that thoroughly, and then we can actually go ahead and plant our seed in there uh, to get it going. Just like with other plantings, we might want to think about one or two seeds in there, um, maybe three or four, depending on what types of seeds we have. If we're having poor germination to make sure we get seedlings that get going um, and our timing is correct. For a lot of Wyoming, we might want to think about starting these seeds anywhere from two to four weeks before they actually go out into the garden space. For some of our more delicate plants, uh, we want to make sure that they're not too large when we actually transplant them. Mm -hmm.